It's the return of the dragon, exercises in futility. Today we're going to talk about six pack short cock and the towel row. Let's go. This exercise is called a three position towel roll. Uh, really good exercise when you don't have any waist to do and uh, also very, very good for building detail. I wouldn't trust this guy and, to detail uh, this a prelude. This exercise is basically all you're using is just a towel. The muscles you're going to work yeah, on I brought some is going to be today. your actually entire back. Because the first position is going to be at the belly button. Second position it's is going to be at the chest button. line or the nipple line. Last one is going to be at the uh, Adam's apple, which works on your upper back. That's, that's Dude looks like a waiter at a dim sum restaurant. Can't you so see him pushing one of those little carts riders? full of yes. dim sum, handing out Good. towels before the meal? Chest out. And notice the towel. You want to get the towel to be really tight. Notice how there's okay, no actual tight. resistance. Okay, so now let's go ahead and pull it towards your belly button. Okay, there you go. Good. If Buddhist priests yeah, could be child molesters, here, they'd look like this sure guy. Dan's making it tight look at his face. Notice, let's get a view right here. Notice on how tight the towel is. So, and you notice that there's no way, and uh, it's pretty tough for Dan. He's actually straining a little bit, and we haven't even done a Pour on the towel! Very effective exercise. Let's go a little higher, Dan, to your chest. Good. Perfect. And you can probably see the contraction in Dan's back. And let's go a little higher to your Adam's apple now. And really bring out that upper back definition. See, Pete Rubish needs to stop being a pussy and okay, do towel right. rows we'll in front right of his there. washer and dryer. Right, not that so deadlifting crap. That's not that's, gonna detail I, your it back. It's like, you know, it's just a towel that's really hard. Yeah. Like, I'm really feeling that right now. Yeah, and the thing about this exercise is, if you're very, very strong, then you won't be doing this stupid ass exercise. And if you're not that strong, well, same thing. You're just gonna hold the towel a little weaker or a little lighter, but it works with uh, works with everybody at different levels. So, really good exercise. Can I max out on this? And part of the back what if I do West Side? Program. Um, let me see this towel here. And uh, some of the mistakes. I will give on him one, one thing really though. That's a really white towel. The towel Dude knows enough. his laundry. And the reason why is two longs can make it white. Why this workout. Uh, this exercise works so well is because you have constant tension. The moment you grab it out like this, you're tensing up your back, you're tensing up some of your triceps, your shoulders. But if you fucking hell, Bruce like Lee this, is rolling in his grave like this, right now. Well, you know, there's no uh, there's no tension, so you basically might as well just put the towel down and just go like this with nothing. In your this hand. is what I fucking hate so most about sure the fitness industry. You really if you're decent looking, on this, uh, you can make up any bullshit you want, and people effective. will buy it hook, line, and stinker uh, because they're desperate. So one thing I noticed is that when you're tired, it's very difficult to keep a lot of tension in the towel. To hold on to your hentai pillow? Tell, uh, if they have enough, uh, enough tension, like when they're real tired. Um, well, you want to make sure that the towel... Here, why don't you go ahead and grab onto this. So let's go ahead and demonstrate that tension. Are you sure? He might overtrain. key to this exercise. So grab a tight, so... That face, you though. You see that the towel is pretty Acting tight. gains. And uh, is this pretty tough for you right now, Dan? Yeah. Just holding this is really hard. Really holding this, right? So... You see how the towel, you can move it, but I'm, I'm hitting it. So I want to know what opium they were smoking really, when they really came up with tough. this fucking and, idea. Y'all can't see here on the camera, but I can actually feel, you know, Dan trembling. His muscles are trembling Nice right nails. Now. This is actually an isometric move. Okay, that's good, Dan. And the isometric move, uh, movement is basically to where you're not moving anything. You're not moving any movement, but your muscles are contracted and working at the same time. If you'd like so, to see more of these really idiots, really look in the description the box for a link to my oh, so, six pack so shortcuts so coaches good. the worst uh, squats how slow ever should video. Should this be like extremely slow bringing it back or moderate speed? Um, um, a moderate speed. Yeah. A moderate speed. So basically, you don't want to rush it a lot because uh, when you do, yeah, you don't want to get towel snaps. You start losing tension on the towel. So you want to go ahead and keep it tight, chest out, and when you bring it here, just have a speed just enough. To make sure the towel is tight. When you start going fast, you'll notice that the towel sometimes. Why did the up. Asian guy run oh, outside with a knife so and fork? Just keeping it kind of moderate. Be because good. he heard it was raining cats and dogs. Okay, so. Thanks, I'll be here one. all night. Back in the gym! I love how it says human performance on the TV in the background, and this guy's doing towel rows. That's like a strip club that says beautiful girls, and inside it's just a bunch of swamp donkeys. Ichabod gain. Alright, now hang yourself with it.